Hi, it's me, Lucas Ross, CFA, CPA, and Realtor. I'm here to help you make money in real estate. And I'm going to put together today a primer about the ADU laws in Seattle. So the accessory dwelling unit laws in Seattle, they tra changed pretty dramatically in July 2019. And I'm going to keep you update, uh, updated on what that means to you. Okay. So ADU, first of all, accessory dwelling unit. There's two types, okay? There's attached, ooh, wow. Attached and detached, okay? Attached means attached to the home um, and it's typically in the basement. We'll call this like, you know, otherwise known as mother-in-law apartment, right? Detached, we often call those cottages, backyard cottages, okay? So here's some of the, um, the things that changed uh, which which uh, I'll outline right now. So the minimum lot square footage was 4,000. So you needed to have a 4,000 square foot lot before you could start, you know, building detached cottages behind you and stuff like that. That changed to 3,200. So the lot size got smaller. Owner occupied. You used to have to, as the owner, live in either the main home or the or the mother-in-law apartment or if there was a cottage you either have to live in the cottage or the main home that was the owner occupied requirement owner had to occupy uh no longer so the owner can have a main home and a cottage not live there at all rent out both perfectly legal no problem um dedicated parking spot you used to have to have uh, a parking spot for your, your accessory dwelling unit, right? But now you don't. Finally, you used to have to choose, you know, you, you could have one or the other, not both, right? So you used to have just one. Now you can have both. So the rule is you can have two of these and none of those, or you can have one of these and one of those. You can't have two detached cottages. So if you add up all of these changes, it's pretty significant because before it was very limited. There was very, very few people were really building them because it was a huge hassle and there was a lot of restrictions. Now, at least they've, they've released a lot of these uh, restrictions. And so it's gonna make it more attractive for people to, to uh, go with the ADUs. And, and just for like, just for fun, right now, someone can buy a lot and they can essentially uh, have, they can build three homes. So you can build the house and with a, with a basement apartment and a, and a cottage. And then you can just basically treat all three like a triplex, meaning you can, you don't have to live there. You can just move away and you can keep all three as rental units. So this is a pretty big change for the city of Seattle. It's not going to jumpstart a huge boom in, in construction because you still have to deal with all of the permits and the, and the, and the costs associated with uh, dealing with the city. However, um, it will increase the supply of housing in, in the city uh, as well as put some more constraints on parking within the neighborhoods. LucasRoth.com is the website. Check me out there. Please hit like and subscribe. Appreciate you watching the video.